This demonstration shows how to build a real-time P300 brain-computer interface using OpenVibe and Lab Streaming Layer with a Cognionics headset. First, we'd like to show you how fast and easy it is to set up our dry sensor systems. In this uncut and unedited sequence, our subject is applying an 8-channel variant optimized for P300 detection of the Quick20 headset. The dry electrode headset goes on quickly since there are minimal adjustments and no loose wires. In under 30 seconds, we have established contact and are successfully measuring EEG on all channels. Raw, unfiltered signal from 0.5 to 100 Hz is shown, demonstrating the high fidelity of our systems, made possible by an advanced combination of sensors, mechanics, and electronics. With the headset in place, we can now start the lab streaming layer outlet with a single button click. In the OpenVibe acquisition server, we select the LSL driver. The output from our system is already detected. Here, we are configuring the driver to enable automatic drift correction. To check the signal quality, we have a simple scenario set up to display the raw EEG filtered EEG, plus a time frequency map. In addition to building BCIs, OpenVibe includes a variety of real-time visualization tools. On the left-hand side, you can see a spectrogram of the EEG signal showing band power over time. On the top right-hand side, you can see the raw EEG signal. On the bottom right-hand side, you can see the EEG signal after passing it through a simple bandpass filter provided by OpenVibe. We can perform a simple quality check by looking at eye blinks. As the subject closes her eyes, you can see the alpha burst in both the EEG and the spectrogram. This sequence demonstrates how quick and effortless it is to set up our system and software. For the P300 speller, we start by collecting some pilot data from the subject by asking her to focus on a sequence of letters. This will be used to train the filters and classifiers. Here is a replay of the entire training session in high speed. You can see the raw EEG at the bottom half of the screen, as well as the time averaged response of targets and non-targets. As enough epics are collected, you can clearly see the P300 evoked response shown in green. Likewise, the red traces show the non-targeted responses, which do not have the characteristic peak. With the training complete, we can now conduct an online experiment. The subject is asked to spell out dry EEG. Here is the first letter, D. For this speller, we are using the XDON scenario provided as part of the OpenVibe installation. Only a few modifications have been made, primarily to select the correct channels from the LSL data stream. In this demonstration, we have used 12 total repetitions per character. It is likely that higher performance can be achieved with a customized scenario and the use of our system's wireless hardware triggering. However, we want to show you just how easy it is to get started using freely available tools and minimal modifications. Our subject has successfully spelled out dry EEG, completing our demonstration. The software tools shown here are compatible with our entire family of mobile EEG products, ranging from 72-channel high-density headsets to smaller headbands. For more information, please contact us. Thank you for watching.